Howdy folks, it's uh, Concrete Buddy here and uh, ready for some uh, sports car talk or hobby talk. Um, I got a uh, quite a few things on my plate today. Um, got a, a, a couple of VRs, uh, um, wins that uh, came in the mail, a, uh, a, a friend mail that came in the mail, and a couple of recent pickups here. And uh, just to start off with these uh, recent pickups, um, these are uh, two uh, postcards that were uh, uh, produced uh, between 1908 and 1914, uh, baseball-themed postcards. And uh, they were produced by the, uh, 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 they were drawn by uh, Tom Brown. Tom Brown was uh, a famous cartoonist of the day. He was the one who uh, created the uh, Johnny Walker um, whiskey character. And uh, he uh, uh, created many, many uh, other cartoon type uh, illustrations. And uh, he has a, uh, uh, a baseball series that he created. And uh, these are uh, two of them. Uh, you know, like I said, they're from about 1908 to 1914. And uh, they're just kind of like neat little uh, cards, just kind of, uh, you know, comic baseball type stuff. And, uh, and as you can see, basically, you're just. Uh, they're just a typical uh, postcard, but uh, I just thought they were really neat. So, um, and uh, I thought all the uh, illustrators out there would uh, really enjoy this, which kind of uh, segues me into uh, my next topic. And uh, I got a, uh, a VR win from uh, Reindeer Studios. And uh, let me show you that, uh, what I got from uh, Scott at Reindeer Studios. Yeah, I got this uh, really neat uh, t-shirt I won on uh, um, Scott's uh, Reindeer Studio VR contest and uh, got this off his Etsy store and uh, it's really pretty neat. Uh, I really, really like it to be honest with you. Uh, it, it's just a handsome, handsome, nice shirt. So uh, anyway, uh, thank you, Scott. Um, people, you ought to check out his Etsy store. He's got a lot of neat stuff in there and... Uh, just you know just great stuff so uh, go ahead and check out his Etsy store I'll, I'll try and leave a link in the description below and uh, uh, Scott's a big illustrator and I thought he'd appreciate the uh, link with those uh, Tom Brown postcards I showed earlier and now I'm going to uh, uh, transition into a nice little uh, friend mail gift I got from another uh, Scott uh, Scott at uh, Stooks Collectibles hold on a second um, also, I got this from uh, Scott at uh, Stooks uh, Collectibles. Um, he knows my uh, affinity for uh, non-sports type stuff. And uh, he got me this uh, 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 collection of uh, Men of America uh, booklets. And uh, it's, 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 you know, quite a few of the booklets. And uh, the uh, carrying case, which uh, comes with it, and, uh, you know, he gave me, you know, a, a, a good starter's lot in the, these Men of America booklets. And these are really neat. They're, they're you know, circa 1928, 29, maybe 1930. Um, you know, it features prominent uh, men in America, obviously, from uh, that time period or up to that time period. So to have people like, you know, uh, George uh, Westinghouse or uh, George Washington and uh, just kind of showing you just kind of you know flips through talking about uh, each of uh, these people so uh, they're really really neat booklets so uh, I I'm really really happy to have them and, and I'm going to go ahead and uh, I'm going to enjoy going through each and every one of these so uh, thank you Scott uh, uh, people also, you should check out uh, uh, Scott's channel at uh, uh, Stooks Collectibles, and and I'll put a description, I'll put a link in the description below uh, for his channel. Uh, most of you probably already subscribed to him, but you ought to really check him out. And um, got uh, one final thing from uh, Eddie's Eddie's Cardboard Chaos. Uh, I, I I was lucky enough to win a VR there, so uh, if you can hold on one second. Uh, finally, I got this. Uh, uh, from Eddie at Eddie's Cardboard Chaos. I want a VR. I went ahead and kind of pulled it out of the envelope 
just because uh, I just figured it was uh, easier that way. And Eddie likes to use the uh, blue... T oh, Eddie wrote something. George, sorry, this took so long to get to you. I have not seen you with much non-baseball or boxing stuff, but I thought you might like this anyway. Thank you for always supporting the channel. Best wishes, Eddie. Well, thank you, Eddie. All right. Let's see what Eddie got here. Um, it's with, uh, obviously, with the blue tape. So, uh, Eddie's a big fan of uh, using blue tape. I'm a big duct tape fan myself, but, you know, hey, that's just me. Oh, this is really nice. Oh, this is really, really nice. This is a, a, a an Arbuckle card, and I, and I actually don't have this one yet. Um, it's really funny because I'm actually working on this set. This is the uh, Arbuckle uh, Sports and Pastimes of Nations. This is pretty neat. You can see uh, it's got France, and it uh, shows uh, tennis and... Uh, Fencing and billiards. This is really nice, Eddie. I, I, it's kind of weird that you got this, and uh, I'm gonna have to do a video on the on the cards I already have now, for this. But this fits in nicely. I, I actually did not have this one, so this is very good. I, I think this is gonna be my tenth or eleventh card in the set. It's a set of fifty cards, but uh, this is really a nice set. So thank you, Eddie. That was this was great. This is great. I mean, that's just an awesome card. Wow. Great. Anyway, uh, people, collect what you like. Uh, uh, don't don't feel like you got to collect the same thing everybody else collects. I mean, you can have lots of fun with good cards like this and really enjoy yourself. Or or you know these these Men of America booklets. They're just really nice. Or those uh, uh, Tom Brown postcards I showed you. People collect what you like. Um, everybody have a, a, a good time at the National and enjoy yourself. And um, just uh, just just have a great day. Um, thank you very much. And uh, take care, people. Bye bye. Okay, folks. One last card. I forgot. Um, since we're coming up on the 55th anniversary of uh, man landing on the moon, I'd. Uh, Thought I'd uh, show off the uh, Neil Armstrong uh, Commodex card. This is from uh, 1969, and uh, this uh, kind of was similar to the top set, but but you know completely different photographs. But what's interesting here is, unlike the the top set, this one was from uh, before he uh, landed on the moon because it talks about Neil Armstrong and he is uh, uh, designated to be the first man to set foot on the moon on Apollo 11. So I, I don't know if this would be like a pre-rookie card of uh, Neil Armstrong, but uh, 55 uh, years ago, uh, uh, Neil Armstrong was the first man to set on the moon. Anyway, like I said, people, collect what you like. Uh, have a great day and uh, enjoy the national for, for everybody that's going. Take care, people. Bye-bye.